Get your ass up and work. It seems like no one wants to work these days. Hey, y'all. Look at this travesty. This is a travesty. And then look at Kobe. Kobe. This is a travesty. What are we going to do? Honestly, don't know, but I got to get my shit together because Anthro um, pop-up shop is tomorrow. I apologize for the lighting. The lighting kind of sucks in here right now because the sun is like setting-ish, I guess. Anyways, um, so as you can see, I have like a little jungle over there in the corner. And I just got a lot going on. There's a lot of stuff I got to throw out, a lot of stuff I got to organize. Um, but we're going to work on that a different day. For now, we're just going to work on the candles that I'm going to bring. I told you it's kind of scary in here. But anyways, I'm going to get this reorganized too. And then I'm going to bring my best selling fragrances to this pop-up. Because why not? And oh my gosh, I opened this. It smells so good. I wish I could smell it. It's like a combination of all four of these fragrances. It smells so good. Anyway, so for my best sellers, I am bringing uh, oh, passion fruit, sweet amber, happy hour. I had oat milk in there just from my last pop-up shop, but I'm gonna switch that label out and then I'm gonna replace it with limoncello. So I'll be having happy hour, limoncello, sweet amber, passion fruit. And then I think I'm gonna bring like 25 candles total um there's already a few in there from the batch that i had previously like i said from my last pop-up shop and then i'm gonna add some more here too just to even out the number the amount that i'm bringing and then i also need to like label these not label these what am i talking about um i need to put the stamps on these so that's what i gotta do next and then um i somewhat look organized over there but not quite not not too much on me not too much no god not too much on me not too much um thankfully i just ordered some more wax so my wax should be here tomorrow um and then i need to clean this up because bruh anyways so i'm just gonna be like labeling some things right now because i have a few candles and then like of course clean them off make sure they're all nice and prepped and pretty for the events um label them and then package them away and then i'm gonna like just put everything up on the side of the wall <laughs> until tomorrow thank god it's not like a super early market and i have the ability to just go you know whenever because he told me like it they open at 10 but like the market is like from 12 to 4. he told me i can come like how early as i want and then i can stay as late as i want which is a plus because I'm gonna be here all day <laughs> trying to get that coin you feel me so i'm gonna do 10 i think that goes at six so i'm gonna do 10 to 6 tomorrow um yeah it shouldn't be too much i just have to label these few candles that i made the other day and then um i'll be rocking and look rolling once i get everything all set up properly i know i'm for sure taking this even though it is an indoor event I'm going to still just take it so it's easier just to, you know, manage and to haul around. Um, I got more jars that I need to take out. Clearly, like, running a business and working a full-time job and then working, like, three other jobs at the same time is just not going to work. But anyways, um, this is what my stamps look like. I actually want to get a better one. I, got, I want to get a see-through, like, a clear one. So that I'm able to see what it looks like when I stamp my little baggies that I have over there. So that's something that I need to work on and to get better ones with that. And then of course I got this from No Issue. I really like it. I just just wish the um, I wish the stamp was honestly a little bigger. So not not too much, not too much on me over there. Not too much. And then I had this really cool idea at my last pop up shop that I was gonna do, but that was a flop. We'll talk about that a different day. And I was going to like put these labels on the ice cream, well, popsicle packages. I mean, technically, I can still probably do that tomorrow, but I don't know if that's the vibe that I want to give off because it's not going to be outside, it's going to be inside. So I don't know. But yeah, I printed off tons of these because I was like, ooh, it's going to be so fun. It's going to be outside. It's going to be hot. People are going to want a popsicle. Why not? You know? But no. I got these little, I don't know if you say like cloche or cloche. 
I'm fake bougie, so I, no, I'm real bougie, so I like to use cloche, even though it's probably cloche. But I got these from Ikea. And then, of course, you know, I got these little planters from Target. And they just match my vibe, and I really, I really love it. Then I have little pompous grass that I, that barely fits in the planters, but I'm going to bring them anyway. And then the good thing about these also, they have, like, these little bottoms that come with them. Ah! I don't look too much, but, um. So yeah, I'm super excited for that. Luckily, everything is still packed away from my last pop-up shop. All I did was just move it from the hallway, or excuse me, from my car to the hallway to the spare. So that worked out. Let's see what's in. Last but not least, I gotta clean my bag. I'm telling you, all I do is just clean shit when it comes to all it is. Oh, okay, perfect. So then in here, I have, um, I'm not going to be doing like the sample sets this time because I need to reorder some more. Um, I need to, <laughs> why would I do that? I need to reorder some more of the little jars. And what I mean by like the sample sets, basically like these. I have these. Is it focusing? Okay, so I have these and then like, you know, like the labels and stuff. And then like a little sample set. But I think right now my main focus is just selling candles in its entirety and... But you know when I always take away a product and add it back, that's when people want to ask about it. So I'm gonna just keep it right there. If people really want it, then you know they'll talk about it, they request it, they'll buy it. It's on the website, but I don't have a lot in stock right now. Um, but anyway, so then I have my business card. I got some new ones from where did I get these from? Canva. So I thought these were super cool. They're matte. I'm really feeling the matte vibe, you know. And that's me. That's my name and my business. So, and then I also have like an about me type of card. I think I got these from Canva too. But yeah, it's a little nice little personal touch or whatever. Talking about me, you know, gang, gang, gang. And then, you know what? I can't do that one hand. So, I'm gonna just pick this up. And then I have this other like little faux plant that I thought was really cute. I don't know, like I said, aesthetically how it's gonna look tomorrow, but we are gonna do the best of what we got or whatever Mariah Carey said. And then, what's in here? Oh, good thing that it reminded me. So the reason why I have the glass clochets is that I came up with this really cool tactic to be able to still smell the candles while you're not really smelling the candle. So I have these ceramic beads that I got from a small business owner. Shout out to her, got it from on Etsy. And so what I do is I take my fragrance oil and then I dip it in the ceramic beads and I let them soak. And from there, as you can tell, I probably need to like re-soak them for tonight. Um, even though I can smell it. It smells really good. But basically it's the fragrance oil of all the candles that I have and they're in little separate little baggies. And then from there, I take them out and I put them in the... Um, like the glass vessel that I would put the candles in originally. And then I would take it and put the glass on top of there with the ceramic beads inside. And then I will put the cloche or cloche, whatever you wanna call it, on top of it. Real aesthetically pleasing, real bougie vibes, real luxe. But also it's just a great way for me to not melt my candles. So if you like that idea, just shout me out when you do it, you know? Always, always give credit to the creator, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> anyway, so we got more faux plants. And then we got some descriptions of the fragrances that I'll be having. By the way, I need to double check. Um, yeah, that I have all the fragrances that I need for the descriptions. And then I'll put those on the 3D um, blocks like this. But they're already in there, so hopefully we should be good. And then more of these that I ordered these from Amazon. And then I really like these little gold little wire baskets that I got from Target. And then this is what I was saying too when I put uh, the ceramic beads inside of them. And then I put this on top. But yeah, so we'll have more tomorrow. So thank you for tuning in for today. Oh, and then of course, wig trimmers. Okay. People need to trick they trick they win. People need to trim their wig. Clearly I didn't have enough coffee for the day. But yeah, so stay tuned for tomorrow as I, I'm not going to get this room together tomorrow, but as I get it together and then, um, 
you'll see me tomorrow at the pop-up shop at Anthro. Woohoo! Okay, so it is the day of the Anthro pop-up. Is it given? What's it given? I don't know what it's given, but it's given that Starbucks needs to hurry up. And I need to turn on some lip gloss. Um, yeah, so I had to go get my Starbies. I was like, ooh, if I don't have my lip gloss in here, it's about to be a sad day. Anyway, so, you know, I had to come here to get my Starbies before my pop-up shop. That's like my ritual. I do that before every pop-up shop that I have. Um, but the line right now is just, it's giving me like hater vibes. It's giving me like, I don't want to see you flourish. I don't want to see you do good. But, um, yeah, anyways, I'm trying to get me a ice matcha latte with, uh, three pumps of chai and three pumps of, wait, what? Three pumps of chai and then, um, espresso, two shots of espresso. Cause you know what I'm saying? I need that. And then some, uh, vanilla cold foam. Okay. The line is moving a little bit, a little bit. But, um, and then where does, where does truck coming from? Where are you coming from? What are you doing? Are you f***ing me? Okay, we are in Anthro right now. This is a setup. Something slight, something cute. I always try to do like something a little different at each pop-up that I do. And I think this suffices. And then I have the um, ceramic beads. I don't know I'm talking about. It's just probably because it's just quiet in here. But I have the ceramic beads with the fragrance oil, like I said I was doing. And then I have the glass cloche with the bags. Then like my little pitcher and my retainer case in the back because I'm probably about to eat. And then wick trimmers, more candles, more flowers. Hopefully this looks okay. Let's recenter some stuff. But I think it looks good though. I think I'm gonna straighten this picture. But I don't wanna do too much because I got the, the candle next to it. I don't know. Maybe maybe I'll put the candle on the end. I don't know. But yeah, this is the setup. I really like it. Ooh, 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 my toe. I think it came together really well. And then the back, you know, it's a hot mess going on. But I keep my candles in here. Baby wipes, because I got fragrance oil on my hands. And then I got the candles in here. I think that works out perfectly. And then everybody will get their own little, um, baggy and then the candles will go inside of there this is the back the back looks crazy but it's okay it's all about the front it's all about the front we don't have any discovery stuff today but that's okay that is okay and now i'm about to go outside and market because as you can tell there's not a lot of people in here so i'm the type of girl that's gonna wear some sunglasses I washed my hair and I, it's looking like I didn't. Anyways, I'm the type of girl that's gonna wear some sunglasses inside, okay? It's time to go outside and start recruiting people to come in and buy these candles. Hey, y'all. <laughs> we going outside. I'll be back. I'll be like, hey, hey, come on in. Small businesses, black owned. <laughs> Yeah. No, no, it's it's this way. No, no, I'm not gonna do that to you. Unless you wanna be. I'll be back, guys. We're on the mean streets of uh, Henderson. They ain't really that mean, but we out here candles. Get your candles. I'm gonna start recruiting some people. Let's see. I'm actually kind of nervous, so maybe I should just sit and think about this first. <laughs> I don't know why I'm nervous because this is something I would never do. <laughs> you just gotta step out the box and try something that you never would before. What should I say to these people, y'all? What should I say? Let me go talk to some people. Let me go talk to some people. Let me try. Hi. See, they don't even want to say hi to me. That's why I'm like, dang, should I do it? I'm a little nervous. But it's alright, I'm gonna keep the faith. Keep the faith. So, trying not to. Hi! Hope I don't look weird. But I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna try something different. Should I go down to Bath and Body and be like, if y'all want some 
non-toxic, eco-friendly candles. But then also in my head, I'm like, what if people are at my table right now at Anthro? I don't know. I got all these things in my head. So I'm like, let's see. Let's see what we can try. Let's see. She was looking. Shoot, I should have been like, hey girl, you wanna buy something? <sighs> breathe, 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 breathe. Maybe I should get some food. Food. Food should help. But then that means I have to go back and get my um my wallet. And that's the other way. I'm just all over the place right now. My arm already hurt. This vlogging life is not for me. But you know, you just gotta do things. You just gotta do things for your business. Ooh, child. Yeah, let me get some food before I faint. Why are people looking at me like I'm crazy? That's why I don't be wanting to do this. So I'd be scared anyway. And then people staring. Well, maybe if they're staring, I'll be like, hey, I want a business. My arm hurts so bad. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I wanna cry. I'm gonna be pissed if someone was at my table. And ain't none of them in there got my number. Okay, let's try this again. Hi. Or not. Hi. Hi. How do people vlog? How do people do it? I want to sit down because I've been standing so much, but I probably need to sit up. Stand? Ooh, if I want to be approachable. But oh shit, it's hot. Let me sit back up. Yeah, I'm going to stand up. I'm going to stand up. Y'all yeah, don't know what anthropology is. It's this amazing store that sells a lot of Fashion, high-end fashion, and jewelry, home decor things, home goods. So um, it just makes sense that your girl would be up in there. They have air, which is nice. And I'm dressed like this because it feels good. Uh-oh, why is she backing up? Why is she backing up? Oh, I'm not going to show you on there. I don't want, okay, that was weird. I don't want her to be on my camera anyway. A little bit she know. Well, it's 8.30. That's so funny. That's hilarious. I'm almost done with the anthrop anthropology pop up. It was a great turnout. Thank you for everyone who, wait a minute, the lighting kind of eating in here. I ain't gonna hold you up. Um, thank you for everyone who came out and stopped by. Smell some candles, bought some candles, talked to me, talked about what favorite flavors you love. If it's just in the flavors, shout out to y'all. Um, but yeah, so here's my little setup, as if I didn't already show you. So, I really love the vibe. You know, I'm very minimal, although it's just the black and the white and gold, but I wanted to add a pop of color with like the flowers. Um, and I just thought this was really cool. It came together very nicely. And I got my little banner, you know, doing something a little slight. And I think the craft just works better with my bags instead of the white. And this kind of looks a mess right now because I was just trying to get angles of certain stuff. But um, I love it. Overall, it came together very nicely. Don't look at the junk over there. We're going to... And then we got more flowers, of course. But um, yeah, another pop-up shop down. Another pop up shop down, another pop up, another pop in. I don't know what I'm saying, but um, like I said, thank you to everyone who came in Hendo. I don't know why I call it Hendo and Henderson, especially to um, the girl that I met today. Thank you so much. I think her name was Chelsea. Chelsea, you made my day. Um, but yeah, so this is it, and I can't wait to do many more. Shout out to Anthropology. I don't know, one day. I might just be up in there. You never know. Tune in until next time. Peace. Say bye. Gang sign. <laughs> Maybe you just throw up a gang sign? No. It's a video picture. It's a video. Oh. Period. <laughs>